All right, mate. Um, I was out last night. I had to go out with my dad last night. Um, so uh, a little bit late getting back to you, but the 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 thing is, Cody has bounced a lot. It didn't move today anyway. It's uh, let's show the daily chart. You can see it hasn't moved a lot. Now, uh, in this, I, I would suggest that it's not right to buy right now. Um, I, I would like to see some sort of a dip down here on a new two week, and and maybe buy kind of in that zone right down there. Um, so a bit of a, a bit of a dip back down, and then some attempt at a bounce back up. So I think it's a little bit early to be buying. Now, if we go back to the daily chart, you can kind of see what that is. So you know, if if there's a dip, if this is a bit of a topping candle right here, um, some sort of dip back in here, I think will be a decent buying opportunity. If you buy up here right now, uh, it's into this previous resistance point up here. If you buy up here and then it could roll over, you could trap yourself. You could be one of those trapped longs, and it's never good to do that or put yourself in a position to to be trapped. Uh, so I don't suggest trading here. I don't suggest buying here. It's risky. Um, you know, maybe uh, worst case you could trade a new weekly candle. Uh, like overall, Cody looks good. I like uh, Cody. It's half decent at least. Um, so <coughs> uh, lingering COVID cough. But um, you know. On a new week, we could if it flips green here on a new week, we could attempt to uh, you know buy and get into that. The the worry obviously would be you know that that we we bounce up and roll away again, right? Because we are in a downtrend, so the bounce up a little bit and roll away again. So we need to be careful and aware of that. Um, you do not want to get trapped holding if it's going to roll over. So you only want to stay in the trade if the weekly candle is if the new weekly candle is green like here. So if the trend is going to continue, you know, it opens up and turns green and continues, opens up, continues green. And again, again, you know, uh, if, if, if you bought here and you had a top and candle and it starts flipping red, you know, it's not what you want to see. It's not a sign of strength, especially when the market is bearish and, and uh, can potentially roll over. So um, as I said, I think it's safer to buy a dip um, in, in Cody. I'm going to set an alarm right here because there's it's a, it's a pretty decent level. See right here. The, the open and close right in here, but it's also this wick and it's also these wicks and it's also in through here and this wick. So if we dip back down to 26.88 level, roughly, um, I, I might buy this myself. 